We end tonight with the next generation of aerospace engineers. Chip Reed reports from Mission Control in Arlington, Virginia. If you're wondering what in the world made these students so happy, well, actually, it was out of this world, and it happened in the blink of an eye. Here it is again in slow motion, a tiny satellite being launched today by astronauts on the International Space Station. 13-year-old Rebecca El Shwari helped build it. And now, St. Thomas More Cathedral School in Arlington, Virginia, is the first grade school in the nation to put a satellite in orbit. The main payload is a small camera, which will beam photographs back to Earth using an antenna that fifth grader Felix Pellegrino helped really build. We really don't control where it takes a picture, but it does take a picture every 30 seconds. Sixth grader Gabe McPhail is in charge of communications, which means he gets to be on TV, too. And you're expecting some cool pictures. Oh, yeah. Teacher Emily Stocker says it was supposed to be a one to two year project, but because of some setbacks, including the explosion of an unmanned space station bound rocket in 2014, it took a sometimes agonizing four years. What do you think is the most important thing they learned? What we didn't plan on teaching them was the perseverance it would take to actually get this project completed. And we're still not done. Still not done because they're still waiting for the satellite to send a signal with its first photograph from space. And how nervous are you about whether you're going to hear a signal? Okay, I can put it into one word. Arrgh! Apparently that is space talk for please phone home. Chip Reed, CBS News, Arlington, Virginia.